Among more than 60 career opportunities featured in the two-day Gisborne Herald Careers Expo yesterday, where futures in health, journalism, police, military and aquaculture were on display among others. Displays began before visitors got inside the Showground Park Event Centre where the expo was held. Featured in the Gisborne Development Trades Training Centre exhibit next door was a cutaway motor and restored flat deck truck. With a conservative estimate of 1,300 visitors, attendance was well up on last year's numbers. I'm Linnea, and this is Susanna, and we're just here on behalf of the Electoral Commission just to ensure that everyone is up to date on their, um, on their electoral role and um, also targeting the 17 year olds. I'm Baji O'Neill Cochran and I'm from the Karabab Academy. We offer special effects artistry, makeup artistry, beauty therapy and also hairdressing. Our qualifications range between level 3 right up to diploma levels level 5 um, and from 3 months right up to a 2 year um, qualification. My name is Jolyn Kilkelly and I am part of Taipotini Polytechnic, which is also part of Maine's Music and Audio Institute of New Zealand. So we offer outdoor education down on the west coast, ski patrol down in Wanaka, plus all our music programs up in Auckland and Christchurch. Hi, my name is Lloyd Donnelly. I am the Defence recru uh, Recruiter for Gisborne, East Coast and Hawke's Bay. And I have absolutely loved the expo. Uh, really good questions, uh, a lot of people walking straight past and then serious inquiries. That's what we want. Uh, and it's been like that for the last couple of days. It was awesome with the parents here on the first day. Very, very good inquiries and there wasn't so many people so we could go into debt. And today, lots and lots of students um, looking seriously at the future, that's all we want. This is our staff, that's up on the training centre, and um, it's been a pretty full on morning. It's excellent. It gives the young people a little bit of direction. A lot of them don't know what they want to do, and uh, they come out here and they can they can see for themselves what it's all about. Yeah, I think they're really awesome to have this on. I mean, it's a great opportunity for, for those that are coming out of school and for career options. Yeah, it's really great. It's been really really great. Uh, we've had a lot of interest, which is really cool. Um, the good thing about it is having rural schools come in where they may not be exposed to this type of thing. Um, out in the country and on uh, the coast and stuff. So it's been really positive. It's, been it's epic, it's really good. It's grown from strength to strength. It's fantastic. It's yeah. fantastic here. And the fine weather. It's a great opportunity for not only the youth, but um, some that aren't currently doing anything with themselves at the moment. And just the opportunities that are out there, whether it's local or whether it's national. Um, for me, because I don't know what I'm up to later in life, it's pretty good because I mean, for example, Waikato, like they tell you what you can do there and stuff like that. So I reckon it's good because we all get to learn what we want to do. A great opportunity for young men in our school to get out there and find what they really love.